The Time Bandit was designed and custom built by John Hillstrand Sr. and his family in 1991. Originally powered by Cummins KT-19 engines, the Homer Alaska-based fishing vessel recently underwent a major overhaul and repower with the installation of two environmentally friendly QSK-19s, a big change from the mechanical engines they've been operating for over 20 years. We were a little bit leery about this electronic newfangled stuff because we grew up with mechanical. It's just a learning curve and getting used to something. And I think in the end we're going to save so much more fuel and have a better engine and a lot better ride. The added speed we're going to gain on our boat, like we're going to be a, probably a 9, 10 knot boat now. If you have an extra two, three knots and you're running away from a storm, that's huge. You know, you go 100 miles in 10 hours. If you're doing eight knots, you go 100 miles in like, you know, tw uh, 12 hours, 14 hours. And that can mean the difference of getting a storm hitting you or not. Do you know exactly what's going on with those engines at all time? Compared to an old mechanical gauge, you saw RPMs, you saw all your stuff, but you really didn't get to use the engine to the full efficiency. We have the old KT-19 engines on our boat. We burn about 600 gallons a day. And, uh, you know, the thing that we got going now is we should save 10 to 20% better maybe on the fuel economy at four bucks a gallon on 20,000 gallons. That's $80,000 every time we fill up for one month's worth of fishing time. So it's a huge thing to save 10%, 5%, 20% for fuel. It was a no-brainer to us to keep going with Cummins engines. Mm -hmm.